What's up? I mean, hello, everybody. Hello, hello. It's Alan Nielsen back. 53-year-old man sings songs he wrote 40 years ago when he was 13 or 14 or 15 or 16. Thank you for coming back. Thank you for commenting. I appreciate it a lot uh, when people leave comments and like. So yeah, if, if you're here again, like the thing, ring the bell, notify friends, bring more people to this amazing channel <laughs> of this crazy old uh, man. Uh, uh, just to explain, I used to say what's up everybody each time that as you, you know, if you've watched these before and uh, some kind person put a little comment with like what's up and then a smiley face and then I suddenly realised why do I say what's up everybody and it's because um, a big hero of mine on, on YouTube, the guy called Rick Beato who uh, is an American producer and musician uh, his, his, his channel is fascinating. If you're interested in the rudiments of of music and theory and production and 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 just uh, someone's opinion about music in in general, absolutely fascinating guy, Rick Beato. He interviews loads of uh, brilliant musicians as well. It's a fascinating channel. But he used—I don't know if he still does it anymore, actually. But he used to go, "What's up, everybody?" straight up you know and and because i was obsessed with that guy's channel i ended up doing it myself so thanks for pointing out that uh, an englishman going what's up everybody isn't quite the same so what oh hello everybody this song today is uh, written in 85 it's probably got the worst title of any song i've ever written and and that's probably because there was nothing in in the words that uh, made me want to use a different sort of title it's called supposedly wiser and and that is one of the the, the things in in the, the lyrics so in them days I, I just used to whatever the song was lyrically about i would use the the words um even, even if it sounded a bit poo um but this was this particular kind of track was a, a, about when I was at school, during the kind of final fourth and fifth years, realising that school was just an absolute pile of poo um, for working class kids. Probably still is, I, d I don't know. Uh, my son hasn't gone to secondary school yet, but um, we'll see. But when I was uh, at school, th there was literally no help at all. You just did your lessons chucked out at the end, get a job, end of, you know, don't, don't really get care. So I, I was not particularly happy about school, um, which is probably why I wrote so many songs about the um, the girls at school, because I was no interest in, no interest in, in lessons at all. Uh, um, anyway, today we're on uh, electric, just to mix it up a bit. Um, this is supposedly wiser. Thanks for coming back. Don't forget to uh, like and um, subscribe, you know, stuff like that. Leave a comment, good or bad, I don't mind. Thanks for coming back. Take care. <laughs> Terrified of school the next day. Now I lay awake on Sundays, knowing that nothing's going my way. i 
high school was just a waste of time I tell you of places where you can go You build up your hopes and take you on top of the world Then tear it down To this I say no Thanks for coming back, thanks for watching. That was Supposedly Wiser from 1985. This is Alan Nielsen, 53 year old man, sing songs he wrote 40 years ago when he was 13 or 14 or 15 or 16. Come back again next time, thanks for watching. <laughs>